Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to check if your Facebook account is hacked or not. It's pretty quick and easy. So let's jump right in. Now, there are a few telltale signs that I'll walk you through to check. So I'm going to open up my Facebook app here. You can do this on iPhone, Android, or a computer. So the first thing we're going to do is tap on menu at the bottom right. And we're going to scroll down and tap on settings and privacy here to open that up. And then at the very top, let's choose settings. Now that we're in here, you can see at the very top is account center. Let's hit this see more in account center. Now, if somebody has hacked your account, essentially they have logged into it without your permission. That always is step number one. They gained access to it. So let's check to see if someone has gained access to your account by tapping on password and security here. And then you can scroll down and tap on where you're logged in at the very bottom. You're going to check to see the Facebook account here. Let's tap on that. You're going to check to see if any devices on here are ones that you don't recognize. And if the city is a city or state or country or whatever it may be, is one that you don't recognize. So if you don't recognize them, I would recommend logging them out just by tapping this select devices to log out. Another thing you can do is let's just go back, back again and tap on login alerts here and tap on Facebook. See if you've gotten any login alerts either in your in-app notifications or your email address. So if that's toggled on, you can check your email and it will essentially alert you if anyone has gained access to your account, aka hacked into it. So now that we've checked that, let's just go back and back again. I would recommend at the very top, let's tap on change password here and then Facebook and update your password to something new. If you suspect somebody hacked in or even if they're trying to, I would recommend changing your password to something new, something that's long and not easily guessed. And then let's go back again. The last thing I recommend doing is tap, turning on this two-factor authentication. Tapping on Facebook here and making sure you enter in your password and then enable two-factor authentication with your phone number so that essentially for anyone to be able to log in, they need both your password as well as access to your phone, which makes it super secure. I hope this helps. If it does, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.